I was 11, and I was prayed upon by Father David Hawley in Worcester. And I don't mean prayed for, I mean prayed upon. Are any of you Catholic? I was raised Catholic. No, now I go to my wife's Presbyterian church. I'm lapsed. I go to church with my grandmother sometimes. And it's safe to say we were all raised Catholic, but now. Not so much. OK. Well, let me tell you. When you're a poor kid from a poor family, religion counts for a lot. And when a priest pays attention to you, it's a big deal. He asks you to collect the hymnals or take out the trash, you feel special. It's like God asking for help. So maybe it's a little weird when he tells you a dirty joke, but now you got a secret together. So you go along. Then he shows you a porno mag. And you go along. And you go along. And you go along until one day he asks you to jerk him off or give him a blowjob. And so you go along with that too because you feel trapped because he has groomed you. How do you say no to God, right? See, it is important to understand that this is not just physical abuse, it's spiritual abuse too. And when a priest does this to you, he robs you of your faith. So you reach for the bottle or the needle. Or if those don't work, you jump off a bridge. That's why we call ourselves survivors. Have you read Jason Berry's book? He wrote about the Gothe case in Louisiana. Uh, that's G. G A U T H E. Here, yeah, and talk to Richard Sipe. He worked in one of the church's treatment centers. He's an ex priest, mm -hmm. married a nun. Here, this is his testimony from the cost case. Uh, Phil, what's a treatment center? It's where they send priests when they get caught. I, this is all right here in the box. I sent this all to you guys five years ago. Uh, to the Globe. Who did, who did you send it to? I don't want to say who, but they said that they weren't interested. Uh, but, Phil, we, we did run a couple stories on you. I saw them in the clips. Yeah, but to be completely frank, it wasn't enough. You guys got to understand. This is big. This is not just Boston. This is a whole country. It's the whole world. And it goes right up to the Vatican. Do you have any proof of that, Phil? No, not yet. But think about it. There are so many of them. How else could they have hidden it for so long? So many what? Priests. Priests. I know of 13 right here in Boston. You know 13 priests in Boston who have molested children. Yeah, why do you keep repeating everything I say? I just like to clarify things. Maybe you should have clarified it five years ago when I sent you all of this stuff. It's all right here. <laughs>